Sam Epic Mom. It's time for a car rant. Yay! Okay. It is fall, guys. We finally made it to fall. Weather is going to start cooling down. It already has up here. Um, there are still uh, forest fire smoke coming from other states and Canada and such. So that's making people cough a little bit. And it got me thinking. With the temperatures cooling down, we're going to be inside. But we're also going to be getting ready for cold and flu season, kids bringing home every type of bug they can, all that. And with all that, I got to thinking. I want to give everybody a heads up and a reminder. As the weather starts getting worse, there's a very good chance you're going to get sick. And believe it or not, guys, things like cough syrup, um, cold and flu meds, things like that, they do expire. So, I would like to remind everybody that if you've got little ones at home, if you've got, you know, whatever your situation is, go out there and before you get sick, have some cough drops on hand. Have some uh, cough syrup cold and flu medicine. Have that stuff. Have some Vicks for, you know, those nights that you really can't sleep because you're coughing so bad. But get out there, get some medicine as a preemptive measure. And while you are in the kind of pharmacy area, get a multivitamin. Get a vitamin D supplement because with the weather cooling down, we're going to be inside more, which means less sun, which means less vitamin D. So I'm really recommending you guys get those multivitamins get the diet supplements. I'm not saying you need a diet. I'm just saying, you know, if you're not getting enough sun, I'm on a dietary supplement. I've got to take vitamin D. Um, and here's another one, guys. I am very close to 40, which means, no offense, I'm a, I'm a full-figured woman, and I happen to have a family history of diabetes, so I've got to be watching out for that. So I'm trying to be healthier and such. So things that can help. Juices. Not the juices where there's only like 10% juice, but like the 100% juice. You know, the apple juice, orange juice, things like that. Really good for your system. Um, I sometimes forget to drink water. And I'm always big on trying to hydrate, guys. It's very important to stay hydrated. So, if you guys have busy schedules, whatever, just always carry a water bottle with you. Because even if you don't drink all of it down, you know, having it to sip on, always a good idea. And with being inside more, we're not going to be as active. That's just the fact of the matter is that you're not as active indoors as you are outdoors. So, I would like everybody to start thinking about what are some things that they could do uh, to be active inside. I'm not necessarily saying go join a gym. If you're in a gym, great. Make sure you're using it. If not, you know, find little things. You know, it might be a simple walk in the afternoons or mornings. It could be inside your house. Play Twister with your kids. If you can, because I can't bend off. I mean, I got two good kids, but do you, um, those interactive video games or, you know, like with the Wii and such, you know, you got to be moving around. And, um, but again, find things that you're not just sitting down all the time because I do that occasionally and it is not healthy. It just, it's not. So again, uh, it's just kind of a out there reminder, you guys, it is this time of season. You are going to get bugs going around. The flu will go around. Unfortunately, COVID also goes around. So I want you guys to be safe. I want you to be healthy. And then a lot of times, guys, I know we don't talk about it much, but if we're healthy to begin with, we're less likely to be hit as hard by the bugs that go around. Um, somebody who is healthy is going to be able to get over being sick a lot quicker. So just to reiterate, stay active, stay hydrated, Take precautions and be ready for when the shit hits the van. I guess it's a nice way to put it. Because again, I always start feeling, you know, worse once the weather starts going and then getting ready for all the coldness. Again, fall is 
just trying to make up his mind if it's gonna be hot, cold, whatever. It's just gonna mess with us. So guys, please stay safe, stay healthy, and you know, just stay positive. Because believe it or not, that's also gonna help a lot through the fall, the winter, all the time. Um, it's so easy when you're stuck indoors to just kind of get down in the dumb doldrums and you know just sit down and just not do anything and just uh... so again keep a positive attitude find craft things to do but again stay healthy and I hope you guys if you have any suggestions for indoor activities stay active or you know things to keep my mind from going into atrophy <laughs> Or just, you know, some good uh, vitamin supplements, you know, maybe anything like that. I'm always open to new suggestions. And I will talk to you guys again soon. You guys, have fun.